hi friends let us move to the today's plan for shear wall at first in geometry run structural wizard and in the bream frame models i am selecting a model that's width is 2 meters height is 3 meters length is 2 meters and transferring to the geometry yes and closing the grid this is our structure let us see the dimensions yeah is 2000 mm 2000 mm length and width and the height is 3000 mm let's remove the dimension and move to the geometry here we are plan to design shear wall so at front side it will be open and other three sides it will be the shear wall let us first select the air surface select three side surface at first by adding the nodes from starting to ending it will appear as a blue screen add three sides same it will appear blue highlight screen by completing you can watch in 3d view it will show the wall shear wall let us give properties let us move to general and give the properties let us define a simple property that is point or 250 mm 250 mm 250 mm depth and 250 mm width applying to the view entire view let us give the thickness of the plate is 200 mm that is 0.2 meters apply to the view same the entire view has been selected it's showing in the figure let's move to the uh, supports create a fixed support support at bottom assign at four sides move to load definitions create load case details add just will select only dead load here add and close in dead load add its self weight add and close again load case details add as live load add close live load as surface load that is pressure on full surface that is 200 newton per mm square i am assuming and close assigning to the entire view self weight assigning to the entire view that is for total pressure on all directions moving to add analysis and close moving to design design for shear wall at first surface one create panel select add from starting to ending dot four nodes select panel type as wall okay this close is it select surface two and create panel that is from starting to ending again you have to create the panel that is wall panel close this grid and for surface three you have to create the panel it changing its colors from blue to green that is the surface is selecting as wall now i am selected the side three walls as shear you can observe it in the 3d view here and selecting parameter first deselect all param sorry at first select is456 and select the parameter deselect all parameter just select fc main fy okay 
defined parameter that is FC will create M20 grade concrete and FI main 415 as a default at command that is design shear walls and close it at first assign the all properties to the view that is FC M20 for entire view as FI 415 enter view design for shear for enter view run analysis this completes your shear wall design let's move to the analysis let's check what's the result shows present zero errors zero warning and zero notes three surfaces are checked within 350 milliseconds total calculation have done it's just take 8 to 10 seconds to analysis the entire shear wall on three sides of the structure move to output file this is our shear wall design that is width 2 meters height 3 meters and thickness is 200 mm one of the plate and these are the results we have get failed no bearing is available for vertical edge reinforcement that is shear wall 1 is failure and shear wall 2 is also failure shear wall 3 also failure since fail no bearing is available for vertical edge so just move to general and load case details as a live load change the load that is minus 200 newton per mm square and close and analysis the result once again already creating displacement file reaction file selection force selection force file element stress file finish calculating on the total move to the output file move to the design total concrete we required is move to the post processing this is the deflection of the shear wall as animation you can watch it this is the animation of the shear wall how it's uh, how the forces is acting on wall and let's see the axial force that is axial these are the axial forces on the shear wall acting on different forces acting on the wall and this is the bending moment this is the shear force how the shear force is acting on the and you have seen the deflection up to this the entire design is completed thanks for watching if you like it subscribe thanks